the skin games is full of excitement it's full of fun it's full of networking it's full of promotion and we know that you won't regret joining us Hey guys, I'm so excited about this podcast today. I've got a very special guest on here. This is Steven from The Skin Games, and we're going to be announcing a huge opportunity that's never been in the permanent makeup world before. So Steven, if you could just quickly introduce yourself. Yeah, hi everybody. My name is Steven Rebaliati. I am the director of sales at The Skin Games. I deal with players. So we have uh, what we have at The Skin Games is this really incredible opportunity if you've never heard about it. It is the largest, most unique, entertaining skincare event slash competition internationally in the world. There's nothing else like it. Jennifer Rosenblum, our creator, came up with the idea seven years ago. What we do is we host the Skin Games in a different city every year. So we're gonna be hosting the Skin Games next year in Atlanta, Georgia, uh, at the Westin Marriott in uh, Buckhead, uh, Georgia. And what uh, Jake and I are here to talk about today specifically uh, is the, our new PMU competition, right? So the Skin Games is essentially a, a skincare competition. We have categories everywhere from skin to waxing, permanent makeup, sugaring, generic makeup, and underneath each one of those sort of areas is categories. So in skin, we have everything from acne to uh, pigmentation to compromised skin and holistic. And under PMU this year, our newest category, we'll be doing a new artist for lips and brows, and then a master artist category for anyone with more than two or three years of experience for the same two realms, lips and brows. And what we're asking out of those uh, permanent makeup uh, registrants this year and competitors is to submit to us five videos of, of your results. So what that would look like is prep video or a consult video and then a mapping video, a performance video, immediate results, and then an eight week sort of rundown of what that looks like. So some befores and afters and so forth. And then at the Skin Games, we have a really incredible award show. Uh, people have called us the Oscars of the skincare industry, and we're really proud of that, actually. Um, we have this set red carpet, we roll it all out, you go, we award the top three in every category at the Skin Games. We award Esthetician of the Year, $10,000 cash, Waxing Artist of the Year, 5000 Sugaring Artist of the Year, three, Makeup Artist of the Year, three, and then this year we're introducing the Permanent Makeup Artist, and Jake, who has teamed up with us, has generously agreed to a surprise that we haven't agreed on yet, Jake, but um, a really exciting, incredible prize for our permanent makeup artist of the year as well. So that's just sort of like a little rundown of what we're all about. But yeah, Jake, so thanks for thanks for having me today. Yeah, I was, I was super honored when you asked me to join you guys because I know that, you know, it's such a huge competition, you know, worldwide. And so the fact that this is the very first year you're going to be bringing on permanent makeup and you decided to have me, you know, join that, it's awesome. You know, from a marketing perspective, you know, whether it's, you know, trainers trying to get more students or even, you know, artists trying to get more clients, you just, you get so much, I guess the word is like clout or it, it's, it looks really good, you know, when you can say that you've won a skin games competition, you know, and you have that on your resume. And so I, I would definitely, you know, whether you're, you're a newer artist or experienced, like you said, we're going to have master artist thing. I definitely recommend signing up for this. Can you kind of explain, you, know, you, you alluded to it a little bit, but can you kind of explain the process of like, if they want to get signed up and they want to be part of this, you know, PMU competition, what do they do? Absolutely. So uh, Jake is one of our partners this year. It is uh, going to be at the Skin Games, obviously. He'll be uh, one of our keynote speakers at our business boost camp. We're super excited for that and honored to have Jake there. And what you're going to do is uh, click on Jake's link, right? It's a www.theskingames.com slash register slash, I think it's Jake says enter. I believe he will have it up on the screen. Yeah. Um, and click that uh, link, get into the Skin Games. And what you'll do is there is a registration fee. Uh, you will get yourself in the skin games by registering and like i said uh, you will conduct a case study demonstrating the results of how well you are performing your protocols let us know what you're using show us befores and afters um, and, and i like that you touched on that clout right jake that clout for us at the skin games and you're a master of this because you're a marketing expert and guru it's like the skin games is all about that it's all about creating that clout for the newer esthetician and for the most experienced in the world we have uh, like I said, a new esthetician category under skin. So these are ladies and gentlemen with two or years or less of skin experience or esthetician experience in terms of licensure. 
And what they're doing is they're coming and they're getting and gaining that clout. And uh, not everything's based on following in terms of Facebook and Instagram, that's for sure. But we're really proud of that following and we're really proud of the reach that we have at the Skin Games. In terms of our sponsors, like like I said, we're teamed up with Jake. We do we, we like to pride ourselves on being involved with the best and the brightest in the industry. We believe that Jake brings that. We believe that our sponsors in, uh, specifically bring that and we, we, we seek that out. What we're doing is we're promoting you as a player, right? So it's not just click Jake's link and we'll see you in Atlanta, everybody. We're going to be promoting you year round on all of our social media platforms. We're going to be reposting your stuff. We're going to be liking your stuff. We're going to be getting you involved and out there and seen by the Skin Games audience, which again, we believe to be a high end, invested in themselves, which is what, really what it takes. And I, and I see Jake post about this kind of stuff all the time. It's like, what are you willing to invest in yourself? Right, $150 registration at the Skin Games uh, is a small price to pay for the type of exposure we're providing. We believe that we do that on a high level and um, we couldn't be more proud of what we do. Yeah, so um, I guess let's go into the competition part. So like, you know, is all the competition in Atlanta or do they have to submit certain things? Like, what is the timeline on that? Yeah, it's a great question. So well, the things that can be done live on scene, like makeup and waxing, sugaring, things like that, we have a live uh, competition for that. You will perform literally live at the hotel there. It's really high energy. We have a DJ, we have drinks, all that stuff is, you know, it's really fun, really high energy. That takes place at the Skin Games. Uh, if you're conducting a case study in our skin categories that are eight week case studies, obviously those need to be done beforehand um, and PMU as well. So we are uh, demonstrating the results that we are um, acquiring through our clients. We're taking a before and after, a consult video, right? Um, you're gonna be doing five videos if you're in the permanent makeup categories. Like I said, you're gonna be doing a consult, you're gonna be doing a mapping video, uh, showing how you're laying out the mapping of the lips and the brows. You'll be doing a performance and protocol video just demonstrating what you're using, how you're using it, what you're doing with your client. Uh, then you'll show uh, a video demonstrating the immediate results in permanent makeup and then an eight week result, right? So after the healing has begun and been completed, you'll do another video demonstrating that. What, what, what then happens, Jake, is you submit that to our independent panel of judges. Our judges come from all over the place. They are not affiliated with the skin games in terms of uh, employment or anything like that. I'm not a judge. Jennifer, our, our creator is not a judge. They come from different skincare lines. Some of them are previous winners in other categories. Some of them are people with you know, decades of experience in permanent makeup and skin. So those are case studies are sent to our panel of judges. We determine the finalists, which are the top 10. So the top 10 go to Atlanta and uh, interview live in person at the skin games. From there, we determine the top three in each category. Uh, we combine the scores and then the top scores for permanent makeup, for example, will be between uh, brows and lips and the grand prize will go towards the highest score combined in brows and lips, and then same with Nesthetician of the Year, it'll be the combined score of all the categories that you enter. Okay, awesome. And so how many people are typically at these events every year? So our live dinner award show has seating capacity at the Buckhead uh, Weston in Atlanta of 500. Uh, those tickets are on sale right now. And that includes dinner, the live show. We have some incredible entertainment this year that we are soon to announce as well. Um, it's just, it's full-blown entertainment, right? So it's an award show, but there's entertainment as well. And then leading up to our live show, which is going to be Saturday night, March 18th, 2023. So we're still a few months out. Um, is going to be a business boost camp that I discussed. Uh, we'll have some keynote speakers. We'll have our a vendor show and a vendor fair. We will have uh, some advanced education opportunities, um, and, and it turns into to a full weekend. So, uh, I may have gone I may have gone off course there from your question, Jake. But <laughs> you're going to uh, Atlanta, Georgia, and yeah. So, Jake, we have a 500 seating capacity for a live dinner and award show that'll take place there at the um, Buckhead uh, Weston in Atlanta, Georgia. But when you're looking at the skin games in terms of foot traffic and total contestants, vendors and everything like that, it turns into anywhere between, we're hoping this year, 800 and 1200 people that will be attending the show, the competitions and award show combined. Yep. And like you said, there's going to be like a, what do you call it? A business boot camp where we're going to have, you know, speakers. I'm going to be speaking, you know, probably sharing some knowledge that I've never, never shared before. I like to save that kind of stuff for, you know, big events like this. And so what are some, what are some other things there? Do you say it's a three day event? You know, you have the business boot camp, then you have the competition and the dinner, but there's going to be vendors there, right? And, and what else? Yeah, that's right. So uh, March 16th will be um, our registration night. 
Uh, you'll go, there'll be a cocktail party. We'll have some events that night in terms of a vendor meetup. There'll be a swag bag type of a deal where once you register, we're gonna give you a bag and you're gonna be able to go around, talk to all of our vendors and promoters at the Skin Games. They will have something to offer in terms of swag or freebies for all of our registrants. So again, we feel like you're getting back in terms of value, in, in terms of what you're investing in yourself to get to the Skin Games quite a bit in return. I'm sure you'll get a couple thousand dollars literally in swag. Uh, from our all of our sponsors just that night alone. Friday the next day uh, is gonna be our competition day. And that all takes place right there too, amongst uh, while our vendors are still all there setting up, mingling, talking with uh, our players and competitors and, and networking. So our competition, like I said, real high energy, a lot of excitement there, that'll take place that Friday, which I believe is March 17th. March 18th, Saturday will be our business boost camp, which Jake mentioned, he'll be a keynote speaker. We have a couple other really great keynote speakers that we're excited about that will be at our business boost camp on Saturday which will be followed by the live dinner award show where we are presenting the top three in every category. And like I said, esthetician of the year, makeup artist of the year, permanent makeup artist of the year, waxing and sugaring artist of the year. The last day where we're winding down, but it's still a lot to be learned that day is our advanced education day. We will have a couple different options for people that are attending the skin games that day. They can either attend classes or we have this really great event that's sort of, we call ourselves the Skin Games, right? So there's a game and it's sort of like, if you've seen the show Cake Boss, Jennifer's calling it the Skin Boss, where <laughs> we're gonna have some of our uh, sponsors line up, talk about their products and blindly use those products and protocols on uh, subjects that are either at the Skin Games that are randomly chosen. And then anyway, there's this really fun idea that Jennifer has for our Advanced Education Day on Sunday as we're winding down. And, and, and then after that, we'll be tearing down and headed home. but. Um, it flies by. The Skin Games is full of excitement. It's full of fun. It's full of networking. It's full of promotion. And we know that you won't regret joining us. Yeah. If you haven't seen the Skin Games logo yet, they kind of branded it like the Hunger Games almost. I'm assuming you guys did that on purpose. But, you know, I, I, it's cool to me because it's like, you know, I love that movie. And so it's like, you know, who can be the last man standing? You know, who can, you know, industry, you know, worldwide industry. Um, so it's, it's awesome that you guys are bringing on permanent makeup for that, too. Yeah, and you mentioned that. I, I like to even talk about the, the competition side of things a little bit. Is there is that competition, right? We, we're all we're all competing, right? We want to make you know money that our neighbor or the competitor across the street. We want to do better than them, right? So there's always that um, brand of healthy competition in our lives, right? To succeed in business, as we know, the skin games. I wouldn't describe this cutthroat, right? We're all friends there. We all go there to support each other. But you mentioned this earlier, Jake. Taking home an award from the skin games is prestigious. So yeah. these uh, ladies and gentlemen are, that are winning awards, taking them back to their communities all over the world, are presenting those awards. And again, we, we like to think of that as a business boost, as a real prestigious award. And, and I think the people who take home those awards would agree. Yeah, yes, you're right. The Hunger Game, the logo was sort of modeled after that. Jennifer thought of that seven or uh, eight years ago when she started this whole thing. So yes, it is a competition. And yes, of course, uh, the people in the competition want to win, but we're all there to support each other as well in our industries and in our business. I don't think anyone like anybody who's a negative Nancy in terms of tearing anybody else down. But at the same time, um, we're there to win, right? These people are there to win and take home the uh, hardware that they get to be so proud of um, back in their hometowns. Yeah, I mean, competition could be fun. Like, it doesn't have to be. Like, I think competition has a negative connotation sometimes. But, like, you know, I was a basketball player. You were a college baseball player. Like, it's you go out and you play and you have fun. And then at the end of the day, you all, you know, shake hands. That's right. I, I, perfect analogy right there is, uh, yeah, I, I had a number of guys that, you know, that were on defense, right, when, when I was hitting. And I liked those guys, but I wanted to hit it over their heads, right? So, right. <laughs> you know what it's like in basketball. And, yeah, healthy competition, I, I agree. Sometimes that word competition is like, we've heard people say this, you know, honestly, people who we've uh, reached out to, oh, you know, I only compete with myself or, well, no, you don't. You compete with uh, the person across the street who, who's doing the same thing you're doing, right? And you're always trying to do better, right? And so in, in our industry, we would hope that we're striving for new knowledge, new greatness, and new success. And that's what we're all about. Yeah. And to me, competition is not about, you know, quote, being better than others necessarily. It's more about like, for example, like if you only have, you know, one business, like let's say you only have one local business in a small town, they don't have any competition. They can raise their prices to unreasonable amounts. You know, they don't really have to care. They don't have to worry about customer service. And so to me, competition creates excellence because you're always trying to innovate and it makes, it's what makes the world improve. It's why we're still not in horse and buggy, you know? <laughs> right? <laughs> That's great.
Very well said. I agree. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm super excited about this. Like we said, this is the first time, you know, the Skin Games is ever bringing in permanent makeup. And they've been doing this for, what, seven or eight years? So... Yeah. Yeah, I think it's a huge opportunity to kind of be on the forefront of this. I honestly don't do that many conferences or anything. I haven't done a conference since 2019. And so the fact that I'm doing, you know, my first conference since 2019, you know, with this, you know, I think says a lot about you guys because it's something that, you know, after you told me about it, I was like, yeah, I definitely think we should do this. I definitely believe in this. And it's something that I'm going to tell my audience, my clients about because I think it's, it's helpful. And we appreciate that. And uh, I see stuff that you put up because, you know, like I said, we follow our followers. We partner. We're partners because we like what you have to offer as much as hopefully you like what we have to offer, Jake. And I see you posting things like all the time, like getting outside of your comfort zone. The skin games might be something you've never heard of. It might be something that sounds a little bit foreign to you. That whole competition side of things might seem strange. But um, like Jake just said, you know, getting outside of your comfort zone, uh, not doing a conference for a couple of years, then going, hey, this looks kind of unique. This looks like, like something I want to jump on board with. That's what we're all about. We are not your typical trade show. We don't consider ourselves a trade show. There will be vendors there. There will be sponsors there. But at the same time, we're there to help. We're there to promote. We're there to grow. We're there to compete in a healthy fashion. And we're really excited that you joined us and, and, and happy that you've decided to step outside of that sort of break you took in terms of your appearance at shows and events. Yeah, because I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, I think, you know, networking events are amazing. It's just, I don't know, with COVID and everything, like I have nothing against events at all. Like I love events and I'm excited for sure. this one. You know, I've, I've been to Buckhead multiple times in Atlanta. We used to fly there when I was a pilot just to go have fun and stuff. And so it's a really great location. So I'm definitely excited about it. Great. Yeah, and we look forward to having you there, Jake, and we look forward to getting many more permanent makeup artists involved at the Skin Games. Guys, like I said, Jake is going to be offering pretty soon this incredible grand prize for our permanent makeup artists of the year. The development of that is in the works, and we are going to be announcing that soon. Get registered. Click on Jake's link and uh, get yourself into the Skin Games. Follow us on Instagram, uh, the Skin Games, uh, on Facebook, and yeah, we hope to see you guys in Atlanta, Georgia. Yep. I'm super excited. So yeah, like you said, I'll include the link below and then I'm going to be at the event. I'm going to be speaking there. I'm going to be hanging out. I actually am probably going to buy two booths there to do, you know, one for PMU marketer and one for the, the linked permanent jewelry training. And so you know, that's how much I believe in it is I'm going to be, you know, setting up two shops there because I want to meet a lot of you guys in person. Yeah, we're excited about that too. The the uh, possibilities and the, the excitement behind the permanent jewelry is exciting to us too. Something we've never dipped our toe into again. And so it's not like we're like, well, you know, I don't know. That's It's like, yeah, let's do it. Let's move right. forward. We think there's a market for that. We think there's a great market for that, especially for these spa owners as an mm -hmm. addition onto their services and things like that. Absolutely, Jake, we're excited for that as well. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for coming on here and, you know, telling us about this and thank you for the opportunity for, you know, me and my audience. And so we're, we definitely, you know, I'm going to get as many people as I can to sign up because one, I think the competition is really cool. You know, like I said, I think it's a great way to get clout and a great way to build your own confidence because a, a lot of my clients have never really taken the time to like document their journey. Like you guys, you know, like you said, you're going to have to submit, you know, multiple videos and stuff. And so it's, I think it's a really cool experience for people, you know, even if you don't win the grand prize, I think, you know, going through that's going to make you a better artist. Absolutely. Yeah. And we get many of our players that come back year after year because of that, right? As an esthetician, that's what we're in the game of, right? Results oriented skincare, right? If you're producing results, you ought to be proud of those results and, and, and be willing to show off those results. And that's what you, we give you that platform to do with the skin games. We are putting those results up. I didn't mention that, Jake, but yeah, we're putting those results up on our platforms. When you're sending us those videos, we're editing, we're helping you edit those for one thing. So if you're not really good at that, we have some help for you on that end. And uh, we're putting those up for you on all of our platforms. So people are seeing what you're doing with your clients, how you're doing it with your clients and the results you're producing with those clients. Awesome. Well, super pumped. Thanks again for coming on here, Steven. And like I said, go follow Skin Games and then, you know, let me or him know if you have any questions and then comment any questions below. Absolutely. All right. Thanks so much. Thanks, Jake. I appreciate it. All right. Bye.